No earned runs, no walks, seven strikeouts. What does that tell you about how where your stuff was at this afternoon? Uh, I thought it was really good. You know, we could have had a good mix of the uh, fastball and uh, curveball. Mixed in a couple change-ups and uh, a few cutters as well. I thought Higgy did a great job behind the plate mixing it up, and uh, the guys were making the plays behind me. On straight win, does that even stand out to you a little bit? What's impressed you most about yourself during that span? Yeah, that's been awesome. Uh, you know, just um, feel like I've been throwing the ball really well, um, just being really aggressive in the strike zone. Uh, just the team's been playing great uh, on those days that I start. Um, catchers have been awesome. Uh, I think I've thrown to all three guys over that span, and uh, the defense has been great. James, have you felt this good for this amount of time before in your career have a stretch like this? Um, I don't know if it's ever, if I've ever had a stretch quite this long. You know, uh, I've had some good stretches in the past, but this is probably the longest stretch that I've uh, that I've had in my career so far. When you compare yourself now into the beginning, what do you think was the difference in the beginning of the season and now? I think just approach, um, how I've uh, been attacking the hitters, you know, being more, uh, being more aggressive in the strike zone, and then also uh, using my curveball more to slow guys down. Close to October here, is it, you know, easy to think about yourself out there, you know, in a, you know, a playoff start now and you just that whole scenario and what that would feel like? Yeah, you definitely think about it, you know, because it's, it is coming. It's around the corner. Uh, but I just, I'm focusing on one day at a time and uh, one game at a time. And uh, I'll do the same in the postseason. One thing that he said there.